um, that we had heard something was going on, but we were kept very isolated or as a vacuum, I guess you said, yeah. Off to them. And that was you, you. You have to take it in the the whole context of the time because of the um, Vietnam War, of course, and the race riots that were going on. Um, but you know, Canton was isolated in a way. We had you know, the biggest thing was um, earlier, like in this, you know, '67, and earlier than that was people dodging the draft. Um, that was that was how it kind of hit home, and every once in a while, somebody from um, the area was killed in the Vietnam War. But we were pretty isolated, um, you know, not being a part of a, um, you know, the university, not being close to a big university center. You know, when you became um, Miss Something or Other, that was a, um, a very big deal, and it was, you did that with a lot of pride, and, um, and also I had to sign a contract that I wouldn't work or go to school for a year because I had to be available for personal appearances, so um, I knew, uh, the only thing I knew I wanted to do was to get to college, and um, I, was, I was a freshman at Kent, and the scholarship money was very attractive, and also because you're hired for that year, you make a lot of money. I don't ever tell anybody, and, ne and since then, never told anybody what I had. I was embarrassed, kind of, you know. I had those friends all over the place. They haven't a clue. She said it's, it was all part of that uh, happy homemaker, the woman on a pedestal, um, and not, it wasn't the me generation either. The cool, the really cool thing, I think, was I was so proud of my generation as far as we weren't protesting because of, of an individualistic need. We, it was for the greater good. And, and um, you know, we, we, we weren't afraid. We weren't apathetic. Uh, my mom wanted me to become, you know, an airline uh, attendant. So, like, yeah, so I disappointed her in that. So maybe part of it was to, oh, mom, really, I don't want to be an airline at the time. They were called hostesses. I don't want to be an airline hostess, but maybe this makes up for it.